Hello everyone, welcome to SolveStream. In this video, let us understand the rational numbers in more detail. And please note that this is a continuation of my last video. So, are there any numbers which cannot be written in the form of a fraction satisfying those two conditions? Yes. To understand that, let us discuss the decimals. So, the decimals can be of three types. The first one is terminating decimal. The terminating decimals are the decimals which end, which terminate, for example, 0 0.5. So this 0 0.5 can be written in the form of a fraction, which is 1 over 2. And hence, all the terminating decimals can be written in the form of a fraction, where it satisfies both the conditions to be a rational number. So we can conclude all the terminating decimals are rational numbers. The second type of decimals are repeating decimals. Repeating decimals are the decimals which never end. For example, if I take 0 0.3 bar or 0 0.333 and it goes on forever. These type of decimals can also be represented in the form of a fraction. For example, for this one, I can write this as 1 over 3. This fraction satisfies both the conditions to be a rational number that is, the denominator is not equal to 0 and the numerator is an integer. And let us come to the third type of decimal that is non-terminating and non-repeating. So this non-terminating and non-repeating are the decimals which do not terminate and the numbers and the digits also do not repeat. For example, 0 0.3468952 and so and so forth. So this decimal is not ending, means it is not terminating and it is also not repeating. So these type of decimals cannot be represented as a fraction. So these type of decimals are not rational. They are not rational, so they are called irrational numbers. They are called irrational. So where do we have come across these type of decimals? The square roots of no, all non-perfect square numbers have these values. The square roots of non-perfect square numbers have the values which are non-terminating and non-repeating. So all the square roots of non-perfect square numbers are not rational numbers. They are in fact irrational numbers.